Okay, sorry. So continuing from, from basically what I was questioning is that does these type of events uh, help the future of, of uh, our youth? So what was your answer again? Yeah, I think in a... I think it shines it in a positive direction, of course, yeah. because, I mean, what negative thing can come out? I mean, yeah, you might be hoarding, hoarding in the end, like hoarding comic books or whatever, yeah. but overall, especially... No such thing as hoarding. No, 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 no. <laughs> That's a lie. <laughs> That's all lies. I don't know what I'm talking about. No. <laughs> anyway, no, but anyway, like... It creates a nostalgic, uh, you know, when you become older does, and then you, you because become normally, like, like these parents are bringing their kids and stuff like yeah. that. It, it does help and it creates like bonds and whatnot. And so yeah. I think overall, yeah, yeah, it's a pretty good think, experience. I don't think much negative stuff will come out. So. Yeah, I, and I'm pretty happy that they they started to do these type of events. Like, are you happy too, Greg? Yeah, man. Look at that. It's a Kamen yeah. Rider P3. Check this out. <laughs> That's like old school, old school. <laughs> yeah. So it's like there's there's a bunch of stuff that's like that's been, been showing up. Tokusatsu, man. That's Tokusatsu. Like, yeah. You hardly that's ever see that. The time. table behind you has freaking Kikaida stuff. Yeah. No. Yeah. That's what that's what I wanted to show. I wanted to show some some of the Kikaida stuff. Let's walk back there. Get out. Let's walk back there. Let's go. So here we go. So. There is some Kikaida stuff. There you go, you see that? There's a bunch of stuff. Which is pretty dope. Kikaida fans. Would I go ahead and purchase these? Maybe in the future when I make a lot of money. How yeah. about you? <laughs> when you make a lot of, when yeah. a lot of money, yeah. you're gonna purchase these? Sure. Yeah. So, you know. Hey, if it exists, off but, limits. But that's Not the thing. Off like, I love these type of events. You make fun. I mean, you make you make fun, or you have fun. Yeah, and you make, make fun friends. out of it. You make friends, and yeah, and you just enjoy uh, being a geek, being a nerd, and just like there's a lot of toys here, there, and even if you're like just, anti-social or whatever. Right? Yeah, it's yeah. A, it's good to be surrounded, like to surround certain things. Yeah, be surrounded by like, by especially because you have in common with like everyone else. You know, you yeah, have all this in common, and you can talk about it with anyone. Yeah. No, yeah, true. So that helps a lot. Yeah. And at Nerds of the Square, you know, Nerds of the Square, we're not that's only us. going to movies. We're going to everything. Yeah, we we all events because we're we're nerds. That's why we're we're geeks. We we do a lot of stuff that are geeky. We love this kind of culture. You know, this is uh this is home. This is home to us, right? So. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna walk around some more and show you guys what else there is. Okay, so this is the hint. If you want something really cool or want to look for something, you gotta get down and dirty. Meaning, get down on your knees and check out these these bins. So we're looking through some Hot Wheels, try to find some good stuff if we can find them. Can't find some Hot Wheels. Oh, uh, this is like recent stuff. The guy, uh, the vendor said that. You know, you can get two, two for a dollar. So it's actually a pretty good deal, especially if you're just trying to, trying to just grab random stuff. Here, there. Uh, I'm not looking for anything specific. I'm just looking, looking around at Hot Wheels. Sometimes it's like, you know, look at these designs. Like these designs are pretty, pretty crazy. Look at the bottom. Look how nice the bottom is. I don't know, just having them displayed all over your room or whatnot, on your desk, or even make ramps for them. Yeah, so if you want to look for something cool, you gotta get down and dirty. All right, so we just had interesting conversations. Uh, a lot of people don't want to be on camera, but today is an awesome day. Today is an awesome day, why? Because we get to live, relive uh, some of this, these memories for, for the thing, for us. Would you like to be on camera, sir? No, you don't want to be on camera. Okay, let's not show him on camera. <laughs> but but this guy that I'm talking to, he has a really cool, cool Funko co collection that he's trying to get rid of. See, look, look, you got Pikachu over there. You got some pretty cool stuff. Along with th these guys, these giants. Target exclusive big giants. Yeah. So, pretty cool stuff. How how hard is it? Okay, I'm not gonna put you on camera. But how hard is it to 
to, I guess, not want to, I don't know, is it easy to sell stuff or like sell stuff, like get rid of stuff or would you rather keep it? Like, hey, cash talks. Cash talks. Okay, you heard that? Cash talks. We heard the honest opinion from, from these vendors, from some of these vendors, cash talks. And you know what? It's It makes us happy though, right? As, as nerds and geeks. People gotta make, make livings. People <laughs> gotta make livings. And you know what? We support that. <laughs> okay, so I just heard music, Star Wars music pop on, and now I'm gonna nerd out. So what are we looking at over here? Uh, I'm looking at uh, Hikari's Japanese vinyls. So we're looking at Hikari Japanese vinyls. Uh, basically yeah. looking at the Boba oh, Fett. Right. Is it Boba Fett or Django? Oh, Boba. Boba Fett. Boba Fett versus yeah. Pieces Made. Yeah. Yeah, Hikari's these, are super awesome too. Huh? Yeah, yeah. yeah. They, these are Funkos too. Yeah. So what else Hikaris do we have down here? That's Hall, Predator, got, got Masters of the Universe on the bottom, Transformers, Transformers. Look, we even got some... Dude, these die-cast metals are heavy. They're heavy. Wow. Yeah. Heavy, yeah. They're not as... I, but I, I, but I like, I like die-cast though. Die-cast is all super awesome. Real metal. So let's go, worth it. let's go walk around, go look for some more stuff, uh, and we should be wrapping up this video pretty soon. Alright, so we're in another room. Uh, this is known as Artist Alley. Uh, we got some uh, pretty cool artists here. Only a couple, just because, you know, this is an expo, like this is a toy expo and whatnot, so everything is based off collector toys and comics and whatnot. So it's cool to have, have a bunch of people. So right now we're just going to be walking.